What's good, what's good, what's good? This is Watches TV. I'm your host, Tom Wall, aka Big Major. We got another show for y'all today. And the title is Woman Unveils Her Retirement Requirements for a Future Husband. Damn. So, so this girl, right? Um, this girl, or somebody, has this requirement that she expects a man to to uh to do in her in this marriage so she expects the man to pay mortgage and rent and utilities okay okay two do most of the cooking three wash the dishes four do the laundry five take out the trash six yard work and housework I'll keep the car seven, date day at least twice a month, and annual honeymoon and vacation, family vacation. Oh my god, first of all, she she has all these requirements, but yet she worth it, you know? I'm not I'm not a I'm not gonna be like I'm not the type of guy be like, oh, you don't deserve this cause how you look, you know what I'm saying? It's you don't I'm saying you don't deserve it cause how you you know, first of all, you know what I'm saying, like, this is a bit much, a, a lot, you know, you, where, where is your, where, what do you, or what are you going to do, is there more to this, you know, you know, so she wants, she wants, she wants the guy to do everything, you know, everything for her. And it, it's, it's, it's a shame, you know. Uh, a lot of these, you know, ladies today think that when men are desperate enough to do those things for the name of pussy, you know, like, bro, no, we're not, we're not that desperate. Like, it's bad out here. Don't get me wrong, but it's not where I'm, I'm, I'm selling my soul or you know, losing a part of me or some shit just to get. A, a woman and to be exact you know what I'm saying this kind of woman I'm not trying to be like trying to be mean to her like saying her looks but come on man like she gotta be serious man who gave who put that battery in her back you know you know what I'm saying she wants this dude to do a all the cooking and i'm telling you man this is a thing man this is gonna be a thing it's gonna be a thing where females are gonna be working you know and guys are gonna be at home and guys are gonna be okay with that it's coming i'm telling you that kind that kind of relationship with them it's gonna be a stay at home dad it's gonna be definitely real America cause here's the thing a lot of these females wanna get out work do all this stuff man you gotta realize this man females wasn't doing that for like the last 2000 years you know what I'm saying think about it right so the last what 2000 years right you know or not 2000 years I would say 10,000 years Last 10,000 years, right? Females never got the chance, opportunity to like voyage the world and work and find adventures and stuff like that. All think about it, everything got started at 1965. Things has changed. It's not really changed from but the implementation of femin uh, feminist ideas. So you know, you know, who was the uh, famous chick? Helen Keller, I think, starting from her, bro. Then females started working. I'm telling you, man. Females are not, are not gonna be, are not going for that. They're not gonna be out, stay at home no more, bro. Like that shit's a wrap, bro. That shit, that shit was a wrap. They want to get the money. They want to get the coins. They want to boss up. They want to compete. They want to, you know, they about to take over the work fit force, man. I'm telling you. And guys are just letting it happen. You know, cause they're scared to correct them, cause you know, you know, they might not get no no poo poo that day or that night. You know what I'm saying? So they'll let them do do act the buck. And I don't blame it, cause nobody's not nobody's not correcting these these females today, bro. So 
her to even think that, you know, it's, it's, it's crazy, you know? You know, she's talking, she's talking about she, she want her man to cook. Ain't nothing wrong with cooking, but, like, to me, the, the, the guy I'm imagining to be kind of like, for her, it would be like, a stay at home dad and I hope that this lady got some money you know, hopefully she got some money because she sounded like she got money where she can do that stuff and you know she and he'll be able to do all this stuff that she wants him to do saying she's you know she's um she's just giving people giving people the you know her requirements her requirements is bullshit you know okay and it's part two right here man she starts going in on the people that's making fun of her calling her ugly this and that but here's the thing man it was at a time you know were females, and they were big, you know, they were, you know, not the best looking, they were nice, they were soft, they were feminine, and those, surprisingly, those females would definitely be getting, were getting married, having children, having an awesome life, you know, hint, hint, they were feminine, nice, submissive, friendly, cooperative, these big girls today, bro, are angry, feisty, uh, vengeful, treacherous, all kinds of stuff. And, you know, you're not going to get any good out, out, like aspects of that, prospects from that, you know. You'll get you, the probably, if you're that type, you probably get you a, 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 a dude that's just got out, out of prison. Bro. You know, you're going you to be, you're going to be, you big hoes gonna be done with a chick that got out of prison. They gonna use it, abuse you. And once you know they on, on top, you know what I'm saying they gone. You know, where's the where's the if you are a, a big girl or you know what I'm saying not attractive? Where's where, where where was the being? You were pleasant. This the these big girls are. It's not a good look to be mean, ug, mean and ugly. That's not a good look. You know what I'm saying? Like at least you know. And she sounds entitled, like, she expects, like, she to get, like, some, some model type nigga or some shit, like, who, who are you? And, and, and you, you're, what, you blown that, is this stuff making you popular? Yeah, cause you were delusional, bro, like, you might, like I said, you know what I'm saying? You have, a lot of you females, you still have hope, cause you're a female, like, you look, it's funny cause how you can look like this and still get traffic and news, news like articles and blogs be talking about you. Looking like this, that's the perks of being a female. You could be an ugly looking chick like this and be able to still get attention, you know? If you a guy talking about this, but you look like this, bro, you can roast it, bro. You probably won't be talked about. You know, it's just because you're a female, you got that little pr uh, precious thing about you going on. So, like, you you got to you got shape it up, man. You know what I'm saying? It's, you know, you got to lose some weight. You know what I'm saying? You got to do a lot of stuff, man. Like, if you, you know, and that's the thing. A lot of these females think that they get attention because they're big. Look, I said in my previous videos. There's two, to you, there's sexual attention and there's relationship attention. Most guys look at females in a sexual matter, unless they, you know, they're, you know what I'm saying? So when they look at you, they're gonna see the best features about you. You can be looking like this and have triple G titties. Triple, and guys are gonna rationalize, to take all, cast all your body and just look at, focus on that. You know, guys do that. They rationalize shit. They kind of uh, close everything up and just focus on that. If you're an ugly chick looking at her, but you got a fat ass, 
he gonna still be with you, baby, because you're a fat ass. Girls are different. They don't do that shit like that, you know? So with this girl, stop being entitled. Stop thinking that you can get any guy you want to. And just humble yourself, man. Look at you, man. You know what I'm saying? That bonding is not helping you at all. Like, come on, man. Like, you gotta do better than that, man. So, yeah, this is my take on this damn video, man. If you guys like what you heard, man, hit the like and subscribe button. Comment below and let me know what you guys think, man. Tell me where we go. Okay.